Hey, my legion. How y'all doing today? I have sad news in the world of entertainment. Jerry Lewis passed away at age 91. Now, the weird thing was, I heard about that about an hour ago. I remember, I saw, I remember, I saw my friend Greg say, rest in peace, Jerry Lewis. And then I was like, I was looking on, uh, on Facebook, and the sad thing is, um, the saddest thing is you have to make sure it's not a hoax. Because people hoax that stuff all the time. And uh, I was talking to my friend Jeff, well, Jeff, my brother, Jeff Callen, and he said he was on CNN, too. It's like, oh, man. Um, yeah, it's such tragic news. Jerry Lewis passed away at age 91. I know that. Um, I'm not mad at loss for words, because I remember... Even as a kid watching him growing up, um, they used to have, yeah, and it said my, Jeff just said my dad got me into it. You know, Uncle Wayne loved, loved, loved movies. I said, I know. Um, he was so popular in France and stuff like that. Um, trying to find out, he passed away in Las Vegas. And, um, he was in this one for a while. I'm trying to find, I'm trying to find out why he, uh, I don't know if it said the cause of his death, though. Um, but I remember watching him, like, growing up with him, they used to show him on Late Night Movie. They had a couple of his movies, and then on, on, I remember on, uh, Canadian TV, they would show his classic ones with Dean Martin. Or they like to show the Geisha Boy on the afternoon movie. So they have like FYI, the Canadian TV. Yeah. Canadian TV, uh, you know, they had FYI, then they had the cartoons, and then they have like the um, weekend movie. It was like they had like the guy, and they do like a lot. It'd be like the traditional weekend movie you see that was on, C, uh, on the Canadian. Uh, CBN, Canadian Broadcast Network. That was Channel 10 when we had Rabbit Ears. And they have lots of stuff. I remember seeing Rocket by Baby and stuff. And then, even in, uh, and in Labor Day, his uh, Labor Day telethon was like a staple of my childhood watching that all the time. And it was sad what happened where, as uh, someone else, he uh, said he wasn't going to do it anymore. And then the people who uh, took over you know, it was 24 hours. Then they shortened it down to like four hours, then like two hours. I think they completely took it off the air now. Or it might just be a two-hour show possibly now. They said they can do more online than anything else. And it's a shame, you know. And uh, I'm just blown away by, you know. Uh, I, I miss my, my Uncle Wayne passed away. Um a while back too, a few years before my dad passed away and I miss him too. And now it says legendary d comedian passed away. I just wanted to make sure. It w isn't it sad? Isn't it sad that you have to check to make sure that uh, the passing away of someone's not a hoax? You know, it's, it's sadder than the, almost as sad as the actual passing, but I wonder, uh, you know, it's just, terrible what happened with uh, Labor Day Telethon too, you know. Um, but I wanted to wish major condolences to friends and family. He was a big part of my childhood. I, li I like that goofy humor. I might remember uh, the disorderly uh, well, the Aaron Boy and stuff. A whole bunch of movies I've seen of his. And then um, with and without Dean Martin. I know him and Dean Martin got in a big fight and then they broke out split up. And then I think they eventually got back together and, and uh, Jerry Lewis did a couple other movies and then he did some serious movies like in The King of Comedy. Dang, that was a good movie. But serious, though. With a comedic, uh, some of a dark comedic slant That's a great movie, too. I mean, really incredible genius and it's a real shame that he passed away. I'm just trying to find, I don't know if they have the cause of what happened. Oh, someone said, I did, uh, Roku said, um, Fried Bullet said, all I really use my Roku for is uh, YouTube and Tubi TV. Thank you. Well, that's, you're welcome. Uh, but I just want to say, 
what a tragic loss this passing is. Wait a second. Yeah, it just says, it doesn't say, uh, wow. It doesn't say why he passed away, though. Maybe you'll, we'll find more news about that as it develops. But uh, I'm just dumbstruck. I want to give a shout-out to Jeff Callen, too, my good uh, good relative. He's a good guy. So, Until next time, bye, please. Take care, my legion. I'm not going to plug my T-shirt in this video. All right, take care.